Democrats move to defend Mueller against Trump allies. Democrats are making a fresh push to defend special counsel Robert Mueller as conservatives escalate their political assault on the Russia investigator. President Donald Trump's allies in recent days have renewed their attacks on Mueller amid reports that the top deputy traded anti-Trump texts over the summer, evidence of what they claim is a festering bias. Several news organizations also reported Tuesday that Mueller had subpoenaed records about Trump's finances from Deutsche Bank, potentially delving into an area that Trump has said could lead him to fire the special counsel. And the conservative legal group Judicial Watch released an email Tuesday from another Mueller prosecutor that it said showed evidence of Trump animus. The developments are raising new alarms among Democrats that Trump could follow through on his past flirtation with firing Mueller, although Republicans say they don't see a pressing need to protect the special counsel. Senators said Monday that bipartisan talks are continuing around combining two bills that would shield Mueller from such a move. The Senate Judiciary Committee held a hearing on both proposals in September, although Chairman Chuck Grassley R. Iowa, has declined to indicate whether he would support a merged version. That isn't he stopping Democrats from calling for quick action. Moving forward on the Mueller protection bills is an absolutely necessary step after the guilty plea by Michael Flynn, Senator Richard Blumenthal decon, said in an interview. They need to be combined into one, and I think we have bipartisan agreement about it. Blumenthal is a co-sponsor of the stronger of the two Mueller shielding bills, from Senators Lindsey Graham R-S.C. and Cory Booker D-N.J., which would require the Attorney General to seek a federal court's approval before removing a special counsel. Booker said Tuesday that he is having great bipartisan conversations with Graham as well as Senators Tom Tillis R-N.C. and Chris Coons D. Dell whose version of the legislation would allow Mueller to seek judicial review of a firing after it occurs. I feel a sense of urgency to do this not just for this moment in history, but to create more checks and balances within the system as a whole, Booker told reporters. Trump himself steered clear of personal attacks on Mueller in a weekend flurry of tweets about his former national security adviser Flynn, who pleaded guilty to lying to the FBI about his communications with the Russian ambassador. But Trump did refer in one tweet to what he called an anti-Trump FBI agent, an apparent reference to Peter Sturzok, whom Mueller removed from his team earlier this year after learning of text messages Sturzok sent to an FBI colleague that were critical of Trump. Flynn's plea has also intensified a campaign by conservative critics of Mueller to undermine what they call an anti-Trump witch hunt. On Tuesday, Judicial Watch released FBI emails it obtained through a Freedom of Information Act request including one in which a Mueller deputy, Andrew Weissman, praised his then-boss, acting FBI Director Sally Yates, for her refusal to enforce Trump's executive order imposing sweeping travel restrictions in January. I am so proud. And in awe. Thank you so much, Weissman wrote to Yates. How much more evidence do we need that the Mueller operation has been irredeemably compromised by anti-Trump partisans? Shut it down, Judicial Watch President Tom Fitton said in a statement. Democrats scoffed at the idea that Weissman had exhibited bias even as they redoubled their push for proactive protection of the special counsel. We should make certain the integrity of the special counsel is protected, Senate Minority Whip Dick Durbin deal, told reporters. It is not that Republicans are not interested in the Mueller protection bills, Durbin added, since they are bipartisan. I just don't think they'll all join us in having a timely markup on these bills. Tillis said he don't see sense any hurry to get the measure passed. I don't see any heightened kind of urgency.